under a building, we can understand it through a range of different mediums. We can visually gain an understanding of that building, its materiality and its context through photos, drawings and models. We primarily understand the configuration of a building through the floor plans. These are the tools that we use to describe, understand and document buildings. We analyze these drawings to derive meaning. How this meaning is derived is based highly on intuition and experience. We can begin to analyze these drawings further and start to extract analytics that are not based on intuition, rather analytics that are based on logic. Parametric design techniques have changed how we understand design. Parametric modeling is like using Microsoft Excel for geometry. We can now consider geometry and data abstractly and create geometry and data relationships. We construct the logic of a design rather than the design itself. And this is a big distinction. Once you start to think of design in terms of abstract logic, you begin to see designs differently. As we model designs on the computer, we are simply visualizing a representation of that design. This can be a rendering, a floor plan, a complex BIM model, or an Excel spreadsheet. In the end, it is actually all just computer code and data being displayed by different software packages. At IDA, we are developing custom software that can read architectural designs and extract design quality objectively. For example, what is a kitchen? What is a bedroom? And how are they linked together? How deep is that space in my configuration? And will it receive adequate sunlight? How does my design compare with other designs? Once this logic is built in, we can access this data in real time. As we modify our design, our analytics update live. This is the detail, precision, and level of understanding we need as we design. And our ultimate goal is to provide better access to real-time feedback that will improve the quality of designs overall and provide confidence in designing complex solutions.